Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and happy Friday. It is currently, oh, is that a crow? That's creepy, I don't like that noise. Unless it's Damon. Um, it is currently 1.33 and the sun is out as you guys can see and it feels really good. It is 82 degrees and I need to take advantage of today's weather because tomorrow it's supposed to rain and I think on Sunday it's supposed to rain. So it's basically supposed to rain for the rest of the weekend. So today's the only day we can enjoy being outside. And let me show you guys my gym outfit today. Okay, so I literally just got this outfit today because I am running out of gym clothes and now that I'm like really consistent and going three to four times a week, I am in need of some more gym clothes. So I got this top and then I got these leggings, super high-waisted, which I love. And then this is what they look like. And they're so nice and comfortable and then I just have my Converse on and then <laughs> there's Nico with his pajamas on you guys because this little boy does not want to change today so that's why he's still wearing pajamas oh my god he's so good let me show you guys a little update they put the roofing is that how you say it the roofing I don't know but we're moving along guys we're moving along let me show you guys so it is finally on and then we tried our best to match the shed and the house but this one is actually like a little bit more gray and then that one's a little bit more brown but it's okay I feel like it's not that much of a difference and the pool is looking mighty good right now I wish I could get in right now but we actually need to go buy the little strips that check like the water to make sure it's like good and balanced so that's the only thing that we need to do so that we can make sure it's good to go so we can get in but anyways I thought it was like the perfect time oh let me get my phone out of this sun girl because these iPhones are a little delicate but anyways so I came over here let me set my phone off by this tree the only tree that we have in our backyard let me put you guys on the tree we are out here enjoying this beautiful day and going to continue enjoying this and we're going to continue enjoying this beautiful day especially oh my gosh don't fall y'all it's really windy perfect for this right here which is the kutek 210t nylon hammock i am so excited this is gonna be perfect because this tree gives like the perfect amount of shade and with a little hammock under it, it's gonna be amazing so anyways this is what it looks like and I absolutely love that the hammock is the bag and the bag is the hammock does that make sense you'll see so when you first open it up you have one strap and a second strap and like I said the bag is the hammock so cool I love how they designed this so I'm just going to get it out of here and I decided to get the black and red because our little pillows that we put on our chairs over there are red and then we have an umbrella that's red so I was like you know what I have to get the red and black hammock so I can kind of all match back here but they do have other colors all right so see this is the bag and it's connected to the hammock so this is what it looks like and it's pretty long which i love so at first when i was trying to figure this out i wasn't sure where to put the hammock and i was so sad because i thought it wasn't going to work for me but i was like you know what i'm gonna figure this out because i just really want to have a hammock in my backyard oh my god it's so windy so i put on my thinking cap and i was like you know what my tree is close enough to the fence right here and then the hammock is long enough and then the straps are long as well so that helped a lot that the hammock was long and that the straps were long so i was able to hang it from the tree to the fence and it came out perfect but of course i had to undo it so that i could show you guys how i put it together and all of that good stuff all right so let's go ahead and put this together so i'm gonna grab the strap
today. I feel like hammocks are a must. It's just so relaxing. I could definitely take a nap in here. This is my view. And Nico is here with me. But it's just really, really nice. And you can cover up. It's really nice. I like it. Oh, Nico wants to cover up. Okay. I'm so happy that I was able to make it work. We have a puppy. Because like I said, we don't have two trees back here. So I thought there was like no way for me to set it up. But I was like, you know what? I can put it on the fence as well. And... Cuidado. Cuidado. So yeah, so it worked. And I love that the bag is the hammock and the hammock is the bag because you can take it anywhere. If you go camping, you can take it with you. You can take it to your girlfriend's house. You can take it to your mom's, grandma's. Um, and yeah, and I'll have everything linked down below so you guys um, can check it out and maybe purchase one for yourself because summer is right around the corner. But anyways, I'll see you guys a little bit later. I'm going to sit back, relax, and enjoy my hammock for a little longer before the boys take over. guys look at my hair i closed my eyes and i was like really relaxed we were out there for like 35 minutes and nico did not want to come inside he is still out there but i had to come in here because i got a little toasty out there a little bit later i will get back on and show you guys this delicious salad recipe that i got off of um i was gonna say pinterest because i get everything off of pinterest but i think i got this off of instagram yeah i think it was from a reel on instagram and i tried it and i've been obsessed with it so now i'm gonna share it with you guys here in a little bit later that same evening so i'm currently making the boys and grilled cheese okay you guys so now it is my turn to eat i am going to make me the salad that i told you guys i found on instagram reels so let me show you guys everything that you need so it's a super simple salad but it is so delicious and i got all of this at aldi so the first thing is the baby spinach and arugula and then we need some grilled chicken breast strips strawberries feta cheese and then for dressing raspberry vinaigrette so that is it it's not a lot but it's really really good so i'm gonna go ahead and grab a little bowl and i'm actually gonna use this super cute bowl that my mom got for me on mother's day so cute so of course you're gonna want to wash your spinach and arugula but i like to fill up my bowl first so i know how much i'm going to be washing all right now i'm gonna add some chicken and now i'm gonna wash and cut up these strawberries And now I'm gonna grab my feta cheese and add that on top. And now just top it off with raspberry vinaigrette. And that is it you guys that is the salad and it is so delicious i am obsessed with this i feel like i have been eating this a lot for like lunchtime it's just super easy super quick and super good mm. it's crazy to think that strawberries and chicken go great together but it really does and then the arugula you guys gives the salad so much more flavor Please let me know if you guys end up trying this and let me know your thoughts. Anyways, I'm going to finish this up and then in about an hour or so, I'm going to head to the gym and I'll try to record a little bit for you guys. Just give you a little quick sneak peek. So see you later. So it is currently 6.11. So I'm going to go ahead and go to the gym. <laughs> I love the chase and the hunt and I set the pace when I'm running I always take what I want and I always give it 100 Don't need a bank, no I'm funded Play the game like it's nothing I'm always thankful for something Don't take for granted, stay humble Now wake up! It's time to look at 
the enemy Look in the mirror if he is no friend of me It's not working out, maybe it's the chemistry It's time to break up so I can make a better me Better believe in your mind cause it's everything Early the next morning I am so exhausted Oh my goodness Good morning you guys uh, This is one of the reasons I love going to the gym and that's because I get so tired and I go to sleep right away. But I wake up like sore. My legs hurt, my shoulders are hurting. Look. <laughs> um, so yeah, so yesterday we did legs and I'm just like sore <laughs> and tired. But anyways, it's a brand new day. Good morning, guys. It's currently 10 o'clock. On the dots. I woke up around 9 15 so I slept in a little bit which was nice. Eric is currently working and the boys are outside, outside. playing on the playing hammock. On the they are obsessed. I knew they were gonna love it. They're over there taking turns on it and acting like it's a whole swing so. <laughs> but I am about to clean like always, cook like always, and then I'm gonna make me a nice coffee because I'm still kind of tired like I slept very good but since my body is so sore I feel like I could keep sleeping you know and I feel like my eyes are swollen but they're not they just feel that way because I'm tired so yeah I need some coffee this morning Alexa is it going to rain today it might rain today there's a 45% chance at 11 a.m. you can expect about 0.17 inches Wow what I needed. Mm. So good. Oh my god. I think it's about to rain. It's super dark outside. Let me get the kids. I think it's gonna rain, Bobby. Look at how cloudy it is. Yeah, it's gonna rain. Is that all of them? Yeah. Nico's missing a shoe. Okay, so now that the boys are inside, I'm gonna make breakfast now. I think I'm gonna make some toast, egg, and some fruit on this side. Take advantage. 
Now it's my turn. I'm just gonna put arugula all over my egg. It's so good. And here is my breakfast. I'm gonna go ahead and add some bagel seasoning to this. Where are you, bagel seasoning? There you are. Most of the times I like to add red pepper flakes, but I don't have any. So when I don't add that, I add bagel seasoning. Mm. You guys know I've talked about how I'm just not like a summer person. Um, but for some reason, this time around, I feel like different. I don't know why, but I feel like I'm actually looking forward to summer. I don't know if it's because of the gazebo or if it's just something inside of me that's changing. <laughs> But I'm really looking forward to summer, guys. And I'm gonna be 30. <laughs> Time is just flying by. Um, so I don't know. I feel like this year I've started to uh, kind of change like my mindset and really focus on me and my happiness and what I want. And I feel like I should have done this a long time ago, but at least I'm doing it now. And I feel like a different person. And there's like a lot of things that I feel like has changed about me. One being that i'm actually motivated and want to go to the gym all the time and i always look forward to going to the gym and before it was more like me forcing myself to go or forcing myself to work out and then the second thing is that i no longer feel like bad for saying no to something i don't want to do you know what i mean i feel like i'm one of those people who I always tried so hard to please people and I stopped that because I feel like before I would always say yes to everybody and everything I just wanted to be that person that you can count on and depend on but sometimes we just have to say no we have to learn to be okay with that we have to learn to not feel bad and then something else is that I am now starting to learn to speak my mind because a lot of times when something would frustrate me I would be just quiet i would shut my mouth i wouldn't say anything but now i'm just learning to speak my mind obviously in a respectful respectful respectable way so yeah so i just feel like there's like a lot of little things that i used to do before that i'm now changing because last year i was just over it i went through so much with different people different situations that i was over it and i was tired of being that person who felt weak and unnoticed and stomped on i just felt like I'm no longer going to put myself in situations that I don't need to be in. Dang, I'm being savage with this word. But basically what I'm trying to say is just I am working on me now. I am trying to be a better me, feel better about myself, and just enjoy life, live life. You fixed it. So yeah, so <laughs> Miko's just going to keep interrupting me. Anyways, I'm going to get off of here and enjoy my breakfast. Oh.